Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the best way to make a verification for your Discord server. Let's get right into the video. So first thing you're going to want to go ahead and do, go down to the description where it says video links and click the first one. This is what it should come up with like, and this is called the CAPTCHA bot. You probably have heard this, and it's the most effective and most best way to create a verification system for your discord server so all you want to go ahead and do is invite this to your server i don't use this in my server it's just like i don't know why i don't use it don't answer that <laughs> so you're just going to want to press the invite button and then just go ahead and go through all these prom prompts right here am i human yeah, of course i'm a human yep i'm a human do, 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 do. now once you do this it will, you will be invited to join their discord server now you don't have to join this their server i am not going to join it now if i go to my bot testing server as you can see this it is right here inside the server and now what i'm going to go ahead and do is create a channel for a verification system to organize this better what you guys can go ahead and do as well is go ahead and right click and cr create a category and name it verify this is what i do to organize it better you can go ahead and create a channel and then you can name that verify and then i'll go ahead and edit edit permissions and go ahead and click view channels yes and send messages to be off and then go ahead and press save changes it does use slash commands so if you go in type a slash and then you click on captcha bot here is a list of all the commands that this bot has and if we go ahead and do slash help and send that it will give you a list of all the commands you can do now you can visit the dashboard which is what we're going to go ahead and do now we're going to trust captcha and we're going to visit site now you're going to have to authorize it if you're, it's your first time using it and it'll go ahead and pull up a list of all the discord servers that you are currently in press configure button on the server that you want to do this in so so I'm going to do it in my bot testing server. And the one we're going to be focusing on for this video is this verification tab in underneath the settings category. So if you go ahead and click on that. Also, one thing I did forget to mention is you're going to want to go ahead and go to your server, go to server settings, go to roles, and then down here where it says capture bot, you want to go ahead and edit the permissions for that bot scroll all the way down and click on administrator and then press save changes now if you're gonna press this administrator on make sure you're only doing it for bots come on it's common sense guys only do it for bots nothing else and now when you go now go back to this site and refresh the page because i think you do have to refresh it in order for it to take place now once you go ahead and do uh this verify channel should not be crossed off anymore you should be able to click on it now verify lo location now you can either choose to verify through a button panel or you can do direct messages button panel is always usually everyone goes for the button panel so we can go ahead and click on button panel and now you can rename the button whatever you would like so verify for access you can edit the message if you would like to we're just going to keep it the same and then you can choose a verification me method you can do it through a web verification or through an image verification we're going to keep it as web verification and now what we're going to do is scroll down to where it says roles this is very important if you don't do this this will not work so go back to your server go to server settings go to roles and then we're going to create a role and we're going to name this verify we're going to make it like a nice green color display if we wanted to i don't know now we're going to go ahead and place this just under our just under our muted role we're going to save changes what you want to go ahead and do is th for every category we're going to edit every category and for everyone we're going to set view channels to be off and then we're going to press this little plus icon right here and we're going to set we're going to add in the verify role and we're going to click view channels to be on just press on view channels for these ones you might have to sync the channels with the things uh and then for the verified roles you're gonna have to go through all your permis permissions again if you want to get this done now back on the site you can go ahead and press add this add role button i know i keep saying this i forgot to do one more thing go to but go back to your roles and we're gonna take the capture bot and make sure it's above the verified role so you can you're able to add it to people you might have to refresh the page again it might not work and now when we press add roles we can add the verified role inside of there and we're gonna go ahead and select this drop down menu and select add role now logs you can add a logs channel like say you want to send a message inside of your server whenever someone verifies themselves you can go ahead and select a channel for that we're not going to do that in this video and 
now you can there's also an option to deny vpns we're not gonna focus on anything else in this server now once you have cu customized everything for the verified you can go ahead and press this post message and now when i press this post message and i go back to the discord server as you can see there is now a new message here and apparently i have unsafe changes so we're gonna save the changes make sure you are always saving saving your changes on the site now if we click this and then it's gonna send a private message to the user so only the user will be able to see this message and it will basically just saying you can verify so click and it will give them a link they can that they can click on and then they can just go ahead and press the verify. And then they will have to complete a CAPTCHA and whatever. And then after they complete that CAPTCHA, they will gain access to the rest of the server. So that's how you create a verified system. And it's the best way to create one, in my opinion. If you would like to know how to do something, please leave it down in the comments. And I will make a video on it. Anyway, that's going to be it for the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoy and peace out. <laughs>